So this video, I want to show real quick how to download the FactorTalk Optics Studio. And this will be the free desktop version of FactorTalk Optics Studio, of course, to download and run on your computer. Um, there's two ways to do this. Um, I'll show both ways. First is from the FactorTalk Hub, which I have um, up here right now in my browser. So anybody can log in the Hub as long as you have a Rockwell account create it. I'm going to say sign in. It's going to um, use my credentials. And then we're going to come to uh, kind of the hub dashboard. And you're going to see a bunch of icons. And you, you might, might not see all these same icons. You might see them. Uh, you might, and a lot of them might show locked out. Being that you don't have the entitlements for them. But there will be one, um, one icon here for optics. So you're going to go ahead and click on that. Now, Optics does require um, to uh, authenticate through a authentication app, such as Microsoft or Google Authenticators. Um, I need to just type in my, my code here. I can beat the clock. So once you come to the Optics um, page, uh, you'll see this kind of banner and we see we have the button here to download. Now, if you're not running the pro version of Optics Studio, then this open in browser button may not be here. Or if it is, it's not going to let you open in the browser because you don't have the entitlement for it. But you can download this version without having any entitlements because again, Factor Talk Optics Studio, um, the desktop version, runs for free without any licensing. So we're basically going to hit this download button. When you do that, it's going to bring you to what looks like the standard Rockwell download area. If you've downloaded any other Rockwell software before, uh, it should look familiar. Usually it, uh, it will probably make you log in since I'm already logged in. And here I can choose Factory Talk Optics Studio and then choose the download now icon. So that's one way to do it. The other way to do it is from Rockwell's website directly without having to go into the hub. So if you're at rockwellautomation.com, if you go under resources, you'll go to compatibility and downloads or PCDC. This is where you can go and download any software from Rockwell, be it licensed or free. Um, so we could get to it in several different ways from this, from this page, but the way that I usually do it is just, you know, one way is to go under compare products and here you can just type in the search box optics and it kind of auto solves it for you. When I click on it, it shows me the, the, the versions that are available. 1.3 being that latest version. I'm going to click on 1.3. It puts it over here in, in this side. Um, to, to do a comparison or to download. So I'm going to go ahead and hit this download icon. And this will basically bring me, oops, do it one more time. It'll bring me to uh, available downloads. So now I can choose what I want to download, either the runtime tools or the studio. I'll click the studio. I'll say downloads. And we'll say download now. It's a little more clicks on, on this route. And then we're going to get to basically the same spot I was just a minute ago, um, where basically now we'll say accept the end user license agreement and do the accept and download. So that's all I got to do. So basically when I was back here, uh, if I would have clicked this box, this, this download, I would have gotten to that same uh, accept the end user download agreement, same spot I was there on the Rockwell site. So doesn't matter which way we go. If you take the, uh, the hub direction or the standard PCDC site, you can come and download Factor Talk Optics Studio. Um, and uh, and then the next step will be, of course, to install it on your computer, and then it's ready to run.